Hi! <laughs> Hello, ladies, gents, and bloodthirsty raiders come to steal all my stuff and perhaps murder every single one of my colonists. You're not welcome in this place. I want you all to go away. The microphone is a little too low. Let me higher. I mean, make it higher. And I mean that in a physical way. It was too low compared to my face. Hey, there's a whole bunch of raiders. Juliet, Amy, Emily, Isolda, and Lou. They're all ladies. There's the, <laughs> the five female raiding party of Doom. They are all going to club me over the head because they hate men. They heard there was a, a colony full of men here. All eating horrible garbage and being toxic masculinity. Just, just spreading the toxic ma masculinity to the atmosphere. And they have come to wreck me. I did not realize they were all female. Uh, let's see. Do we have good fighters here? Shooting sucks, so she should not be too upsetting. Asu, terrible fighter. Somewhat decent fighter. Somewhat decent shooter. A cannibal, though. Be nice. Man, this character. Oh, holy crap. Look at this character. I want her. I want her to be my colony. Of course, it's all extremely difficult. To uh, They are raiders, so it's very unlikely that we'll be able to recruit them. Anyway, another ca are they all cannibal? What's going on? Two cannibal ladies are coming to attack us. All right, Lou, and uh, like, but they all suck ass at fighting, so I think we have a fighting chance. All right, first thing I want to do is for now, we're going to get my muffalos out of the way, but it could be a good idea to let's see, expand animal directions to use them as cannon fodder. We're just going to keep them inside Bamboozle's room. He's not going to be terribly happy about it, but I think it's. It just needs to happen. Hopefully Major Stupid will come my way. Let's see, animals. Major Stupid is still unrestricted, it's all good. Uh, that's step number one. Get the muffalos in there so they're safe. We're going to reinstall this trap. Let's see, they're coming from that super corner over there. It should, it should give me some time to prepare. And if we bait them to be around this area... Yeah, that's right, we wanted to use this entire area, right? So. We're going to put that steel trap right there and the wooden spike trap. We're going to put it there. It should work. Of course, we will going, we're going to have to tell these people to work at it. No, not clean vomit. Work on the spike trap and mostly can also work on that spike trap. And in fact, do I want to build a third trap? Don't even know where to put it though for it, for it to be triggered. We're not going to build a third trap. Hopefully this will be enough. And we have some time. Bamboozle can heal up a little bit more before the disaster strikes. I should have plenty of time. These guys are... I, they are coming my way. But they're taking quite some time. Why is Zolda so slow? What's your problem? You're frail. And you have a bad pack. <laughs> An 80-year-old... 80-year-old terrible fighter comes to steal my food. Uh, she is a great character, but... Frail and bad back and, and 80 years old. There has to be a counterbalance, I suppose. All right, they are slowly coming my way. The traps are being redistributed. Bamboozle is going to need to fight. We only have three fighters. But of course, uh, we have Major Stupid to make up the difference, hopefully. They're taking quite some time. Are they preparing for a while? I didn't read that much. Oh, that's good. That's good. They are preparing for a while. So I think I do have time to create another spike trap. Build a copy. Hmm, do you guys think they'll be triggered if I put it there? I should really put it where they'll try to use cover. So it should maybe work here. It's really hard to tell. Maybe they'll try to use this cover over here. So I should put a trap there. Let's do that. Largo. Nah, Cosmic can survive. You, you need to work on this trap. What are you doing mostly? Yeah, three major stupid, so right. They are preparing for a while, all right. Did not even realize it. Maybe we can treat this medical emergency before it's too late. You can indeed feed some pemmican to Cosme. I am pretty concerned about Cosme not surviving this. Flu extreme, 93% immunity, 88% the progress itself. Everybody's harvesting those pine trees. That, that's only the, like the last two orders. All right, they're going to just hang around over there for a little while. See if we can work on uh, improving the moods. 
Thing is, if I get food poisoning, it will be awful. So yeah, I was told in the comments. I can do that and then consume the pemmican. Move the butcher's table away from the cooking area. I think it's pretty far, but it, it is, of course, good advice. It's pretty far. I don't think it's affecting it right now, but it's definitely it pays to be safe. So I will. I think I will do that. Why not put it right here for the time being? At the very least, it will be in a different in a different uh, room. There you are. Consume that pemmican. Don't get food poisoning, Blargo. You are my one and only shooter. If you get food poisoning, I'm going to be very, very upset. Oh, let's see if we can improve some... Oh. Nope, 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 not gonna happen. A civil servant chased by five, five archers. Not gonna happen. I don't give a crap what your problem is. Rin she calls you from nearby. She's being chased by thrice people. It's a lady. I could use some female power in this colony, but no. She begs for safety and it, she will not be granted this this um, courtesy. Ignore the message. I am sorry. I have enough problems as it is, Rin. I don't want you to bring all the problems with you. All right, Blago did not get poisoned. Excellent. Yeah, I guess you should rest. How about can I no I cannot improve any other moods for now? Alright, some nice heat going on. Bamboozle, how's your, your mood doing? You're as good as it can be expected. Oh, they're beginning their assault. We're gonna let myself sleep as long as possible and then Major Stupid and Rush Baby is not going to be any help. How about Bamboozle? Rush maybe he just collapsed because he could not deal with the toxic build and the food poisoning. Alright, Bamboozle, you're just holding some silver, so rescue Rush Baby. All you need to do is rescue. And uh, where's Mosley? Alright, he's everybody's right here. Alright, it's all good. Mood is fine. The, it's dropping quite quickly, but as long as they don't go on a mental break, we're going to be okay. Numbing cold. Everybody should be in, indoors. Everybody should be indoors to... Get rid of the horrible debuff. Oh boy, they are really close. All right, time to go. I'm sorry, Rush Baby. Uh, you're just going to have to languish on the floor for a little while. Everybody on top of the ga uh, the Vespin gas, so you so you get super warm immediately. Let's see, what's your status right now? Shivering. Come on, you're on top of the geyser. Really want you to warm up, Bamboozle. Ten percent, one percent. Ooh, they're right here. I need to. I need to get out. I need to get out. Blargo, take position right there. And in fact, I waited way too long. I waited way too long. Mostly, also over there. There they come. I think we're going to try and have them trigger these two traps and forget about that spot. So they're just going to go right there. And hopefully, Major Stupid will save the day right now. Blargo is going to. Shoot as much as he can. They w oh, that's right. Why? What the hell? Animals. Why? Why then, you idiots, go in there? I mean, they should be okay. They have lots of hit points. All right, nice shot. Nice shot. Oh, Lulu gets completely wrecked. Uh, hey, people, how about you come around this corner? I'm sorry, Bamboozle. You're not going to do great with the, with the numbing cold. Good shot. Good shot, myself. Juliet doesn't want to take cover where I want her to. Okay, I think Emily's going to totally eat it. And she's going to trigger that trap, which is bad. I didn't want her to. Alright, just one more. Juliet just needs to eat. Mostly and bamboozle. Ah! <laughs> Go away. Mostly, bamboozle. Surprise attack! We gotta go in there. We gotta go in there. Major Stupid goes in. Get some some hits in. And Blargo might as well get in the in the back row. Oh yeah, murder Amy, murder her before she leaves. Everybody pays. How dare you, sirs and madams? Actually, it's only madams. How dare you, madams? Isolda just never got anywhere close. Uh, all right. I thought for sure this would be a disaster. We're going to cancel that one. I don't want to spend so much steel. We're going to cancel that one and build that one back. Okay, everybody, off alert. Did anybody survive? Yes, Juliet's still alive. I mean, that's in five hours. Her right eye got cut out. The a couple of toes got cut out. So we're just going to take her clothes. Yeah, she's garbage. I mean, she's a beautiful lady. She's a beautiful forty-seven-year-old female scavenger. But 
she's incapable of skilled labors and hauling. So uh, even if I could recruit her easily, I don't think I would. Ooh, these, these clothes are trash though, but at least we can use the pants and the, and the hat. Bambuzo, what are you doing? You're hauling already corpses. Uh, go ahead and strip Juliet. There you are. You can even wear a hat if you feel like it. Everybody has uh, some headgear though. All right, um, let's get some priorities straight. And forbid the weapons, machine pistols, trash. Um, all of these weapons, like these raiders were complete garbage. But hey, we got one good medicine. That's fantastic. Uh, now we can get the animals out. Back to cattlemans. Are they still with a toxic buildup? They'll be fine. They don't even need treatment for this. They're not going to use medicine. Um... Let's simply put them back in that spot. Spend a lot in that area. Animal directions. Just for the toxic buildup to be managed. Clear a loud area. There you are. And now you do this so they reset. Alright. We're good to go. Not going to be chasing down that crazy lady. I mean, I could with Blargo. How are you doing? Do you need, have any needs? You, you do need to sleep. Blargo. She's done Isolda. I mean, she has a very long time to get out of here. Major Stupid, how, how do you do, by the way? I did not even check the people. Nobody got hurt, but Major, Major Stupid did get shot a little bit, but he'll be fine. No immediate danger of bleeding out. Everything's going to be okay. All right, we're good to go. But here's the, the main problem that will probably drive us to murder at least one of these muffalos. <laughs> the pemmican is quickly running out, and... That's going to be a very bad thing eventually. Because uh, we're still in September. So we'll probably just have to go out and fight some wildlife. I want to chase down this piece of garbage. Uh, I don't want her to tell the message that we're here. We're going to silence this voice. Isolda gets shot in the back. She's frail and pathetic. She can barely make it out of here. Get closer, Blargo. Mostly and Bamboozle will continue doing their thing. Actually... I would like somebody to rescue uh, Rush Baby, please. You're feeding some pemmican to the muffalo. I don't think so. Just rescue Rush Baby. Oh yeah, Isolda is down with her awful revolver. Uh, yeah, we can just leave them to rot out here. It really doesn't matter. Off you go, Blargo. You have done well. I have done well. Their gear was total trash. <sighs> Off you go to sleep. My goodness, so many crises. Terrible things. Okay, what's the, what's, the, what's the balance here of people? Greedy and beautiful. Undergrounded chemical interest. Nudist, greedy and fast learner. Cannibal transhumanist. I don't think it's worth the mood buff for Blargo to start eating people. It's not worth the mood uh, defect. The debuff that would get on everybody else for butchering a person. So we're going to pass on that, uh, hold all those corpses where they belong. And I think I really need to start looking towards... Let's uh, not suspend this anymore. Start looking towards having a storage of, of meals, of food. Because this Pemigan is not going to last forever. We have gone already through, I think, 700 or more now. It's just not going to work out. It's not going to work out at all. Maybe Cosme, are you a good cook? Yeah, yeah, maybe. Yeah, okay, we'll save this. Suspend that again. We're going to save that meat for when Cosme can cook it. Who is almost ready. Resistance, re uh, not really, not really, not really. Yeah, it's not going to happen in a little while. Major break risk on Bamboozle. What's your problem, Bamboozle? You are, oof, oof. This is a lot of bad things. You're probably going to go crazy here. You have a lot of bad things happening. You're also terribly cold. Uh, can you wear any of these things? There's some pants over there, but you're just wearing tribal wear. Uh, you could haul that medicine. Do you really need some recreation? After you're done hoopstoning, let's just get that med hauled out so it doesn't deteriorate inside in the, in the element. This wood is going to last me quite some time. It's very important that those trees got chopped down because toxic fallout is the absolute worst. That's right, I just I just now remembered. You cannot freaking you cannot 
hunt during toxic fallout because everything's dying of poisoning and it just gets rotted immediately. So we might have to migrate and I will have to make a judgment call of when do I migrate? I don't know what Mosley is doing. He's just hauling some garbage and taking some wolf meat. Oh, that's being used for training, which is okay, I guess. All right, Vargo's sleeping. Rush Baby's healing, poor bastard. You're probably hungry, aren't you? Get in there. We're going to feed you some delicious pemmican so you can get poisoned again. Blargo? Once I'm done resting... Oof, that still takes a long time. The cloth bedroll does not fill up quickly. Yeah, almost trained to hold. That's fantastic. Um, how are you doing? Moderate toxic buildup. Serious toxic buildup. Yeah, they need to stay there for quite some time. They'll eat that pemmican a little bit. In, in a little bit. Oh, well, crisis averted so far. There's a lot of vomit inside the prison. Maybe. Maybe once I'm done sleeping. He'll go eat. And somebody needs to clean that. Let's just let some time pass, though. Get that resting done. Everything's being awful. Please give me a break. <laughs> I, that raid really was way scarier than it ended up being. Really was not too much of a big deal. I hope that Major Dubit doesn't get an infection. I hope Blargo, Blargo should go out and treat them. What are you doing? Why are you... Yeah, okay. I bet you're hungry. Go out and treat them, please. All right, well, that's all right. Why? Is he still... Why are you even treating? The sternum crack? Oh, the bruise and the cracks, huh? All right. Rush Baby is no longer completely wrecked. Good to know. All right, Major Dubit being treated. Good stuff. Excellent. What are you doing now? Building the bridge. I, I really need you to clean this. This is disgusting. So, you know, please get it done. It's absolutely gross. How is Cosme doing? A little more resistance? No, no, no. No recruitment attempt has was made. We have one and two points of medicine. Rush, baby. Just don't eat more poisoned food. Please. We <laughs> heartbreaking. Another poor bastard gets taken to the corpse pile. We love it. Mostly keeps training. Nice. Mostly a major to be have form a bond. Fantastic. Let's see the animals. There you go. And now mostly gets a mood buff for having a what's good? Ooh, bulk goods trader from Kinship of Trelusa. Let's see. I will give anything. For all the food that you got. <laughs> so let's see what you're bringing. Because I will sell my freaking scalp. If I can buy some food out of ya. Uh, to get me through this absolutely atrocious winter. That has not even started. We're still in fall. It's uh, 8 below outside. 8, 8 Celsius below. Which is about 20 below in Fahrenheit. Cargo pods. Please save me, Randy. You know what? I ain't even mad. Some Sim 3 is actually pretty good. Let's see. Rush Baby, are you doing okay? You're uh, you're with food poisoning, recovering food poisoning. I think mostly can go over there. He doesn't need this recreation. Let's see. Everything should be able to be hauled in one in one trip. I would really appreciate somebody talking to these people though. Are you guys hungry? Woo! Wow, everybody's super hungry. Rush Baby, you're supposed to be in charge of this, right? Who's our warden? Rush baby indeed. Will you stop playing games and go feed our prisoners? This is just terrible, terrible treatment. No, don't go resting. Go feed Cosme. Go feed Pep. Go feed uh, Bark Bashkire. Do we even need this guy? Who was this guy? I completely forget. Yeah, we want this guy. And he's an easy prisoner. All right, that's all good. Pep is also being recruited. Winter has begun. Hell yeah. All right, uh, traders. Hopefully they won't leave because it's too damn cold. We have some materials to give you. No, how all that much though? There is a good pistol here, auto pistol. What am I using? A good auto pistol, all right. And everybody else is just melee, so we'll just sell that auto pistol. So, who do we have that can talk? I think it's, it's Rush Baby. He's our best trader. It would be nice to wait a little bit more because he's still super sick and he will be... He will get a, a penalty to his negotiating, no, negotiation, but you know what? I don't care. 
Yeah, you can wear that uh, hat. <laughs> Likes it better than the mask he created. That is... Oh, no, okay. He's, he had to, doesn't have anything. All right. Sparrow, let's trade. We... Yeah, it will, he's sick, so the trading will be affected. What can we even sell? I don't know, but probably that synth thread is gonna have to go. Although, probably the synth thread is, is good for just tribal wear and that will be much better. Anyway, what I want is his food. Too bad I cannot... Ugh, I would totally sell them as slave if I could, but they will not take them. Uh, we could even sell one of our muffalos. But nah, we're not going to do that. It's not even that much money anyway. We have 175, not a whole lot. They are carrying a bunch of pemmican, but I think I would rather just get regular meat. Do they have any vegetables? They have zero vegetables. Also want some medicine. They have no medicine at all. All right, well. Nothing I can do about that, is there? Some wolf meat, uh, monkey meat, elk meat. Everything's exactly the same price with the exception of the pemmican, but the pemmican is, least, is uh, less efficient. So it really doesn't matter which one I pick. Let's just go for... For elk meat. 666 for 225. So what are we selling? I can get rid of all our cloth. All seven bolts of it. The synth thread. We have not hold the whole thing, huh? He only hold 10. Wow. What a guy. We could get rid of the bird skin and the light leather and the light dog leather. These mounts are just not good enough. The plain leather and the blue fur. Wolf skin, everything's too low to be used for anything, so might as well sell it. Ah, of course we have the Ambrosia. I don't want to completely get rid of it, but... The recording was interrupted, but I remember this time around. It's like, oops, I used the minus sign. <laughs> that stopped recording, so thankfully, I mean, I spliced it together, but this is exactly the window that I was at. Thank goodness I remember this time around, and now it's recording again. Yeah, it's all good. Now, the problem is I'm not going to know how long we've been recording. Anyway, minus 20 to Ambrosia. Not even scratching the surface, you man. I do want to keep some Ambrosia, though, because it's a great mood benefit without having to spend, without having uh, people get addicted. It's not as addictive as other things. Cool cloth t-shirt. That's as far as I go, so... I don't think I can sell anything else without selling a, a Muffalo, which I want to keep. Now I want to sell the Synth Thread. So this is as good as it gets. So let's lower this to maybe 100. I can afford 100. I can afford... I can afford like 150. 147. I'll take it. Hey, don't, don't, not so fast. My meat is in the middle of the river. You could have put it in a box. You could have put it in a box. Oh, wow, it's already reserved, huh? There you are. You could have put it in a box and shipped it to my, my storage, but hey. Don't let me stop you from completely screwing over. This needs to be chopped. From dropping the thing that you just bought into the river. Not very good customer service over here. Oh boy, everything's terrible. You are making some synth thread tribal wear. Do I want that to end? I think so. I do, yeah. Do you haul everything you did? Oh, that's why we only had 10 because he immediately got to work. Uh, Bamboozle, please haul all that stuff. And we're going to forbid it. We kind of need it. We don't want, I don't want to, anybody to be trained with this meat. I'm going to forbid it. Until we can cook it with Cosme. The, that's the that's the aim here. Why has she not been fed? Rush baby? You disappoint me, Rush baby. Can't uh, feed her for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, because she was in the process of eating. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> that did nothing. <laughs> Oh, man, that's all right. It's okay. Everything's going to be... Calling this treatment. Toxic buildup. Uh, still has a crack, huh? Everybody else's sickness is okay. Bamboozle has a lot of toxic buildup. Because he's been working so... Oh, there was some silver over here I could have used to buy more meat. Oh, I still can do it. Derp. Okay, hold it over there, Bamboozle. There you are. 
You're still hauling stuff. Rush baby, how about you go negotiate again? Ah, you are feeling that pemmigan to cause me. Let, let's see. Oh, get back there. Merge. Merge this pemmican. I hate it that they grab four pemmican and they go feed it. There. <laughs> they go feed the prisoner. That's so dumb. All right. Hauling out a few more items. We can maybe... Nice on synth thread. Mostly though, although you have a freaking Devil's Trend Parka, so you drop that great tribal wear, put back on Luna. Luna! Put this stuff back on Luna. What's going on? Meow. Whatever activated you. I have no idea. Uh, I want Bamboozle to wear that. He's going to hold that and then he's going to force wear that. All right, there you go. Uh, Rush Baby was feeding Cosmic, which is good. And the moment that he's done doing that, he can trade with Sparrow. Get some more meat. Because boy, do we need it. We're not going to survive the winter without some extra, some extra good stuff. Major Stupid is fully healed. That pleases me. The resistance is slowly going down. That, that was pretty good, uh, pretty good progress there. Cosme, not so much. Because she was starving and did not uh, enjoy. Let's see, now 157. So we can get another maybe 100 of elk meat. Actually, the whole thing. Cannot afford it. Uh, maybe 50? There you go, 53. Hold that. To the pain tree. Whew. All right, we're going to be okay. I think with all these, these will all become meals. Hopefully that will be enough. Something I'm worried about is Bamboozle being, uh, having too much toxic buildup. He needs to stay indoors for a little while. He's barfing for some reason, why? Just the toxic buildup, I think. Toxic buildup is awful. Uh, how about... You clean all this disgusting vomit. No, not refuel. Ah, I guess you can do that. And just clean up around the place. It's absolutely disgusting. Everything gr is gross. This toxic buildup is going to kill me. It's going to be awful. Toxic, uh, toxic fallout. As long as everything stays clean, though. How's this? This. Oh, it's our hospital now, huh? That's not necessary anymore. There you are. Uh, this is Rush Baby Sis's room. There you are. How's this room now? I, I just want to find out. It's just decent. Not impressive yet, though. We need to read, I think, 60. So if we build a few more pots, maybe that'll happen. Uh, maybe another another set of chests. Uh, or, or chess proxy. Let's be like copy right here. We are intellectuals. We're going to build some good stuff. Maybe even chairs. Oh no, I can't build chairs with these tribal nimrods. Absolute morons. Give that to the stockpile. Just finish. I need to constantly keep track. Constantly keep track of the toxic buildup. Should just maybe restrict bamboozle. Let's create a zone. Create a new zone. Manage areas. And we're just going to make a indoors. Expand indoors. And we're going to, for whenever we want to keep people inside, not have them roam outside. Actually, I should not have the door selected so that way they don't open them. This looks pretty good. There you are. Maybe let's assign, no, restrict Bamboozle to indoors for a little while. Really? Come on, man. <laughs> he was in the middle of hauling that. Oh, well, this this counts as indoors, huh? All right. Oh, we'll just let him do it. We'll let him do it. Restrict that guy until until his toxic buildup is gone. By the way, we need to expand that over there. He was completely wrong. All right, looking pretty okay. <laughs> is it really the butcher's table right on top of the campfire? You'll definitely be warm. Definitely be warm. 
when you're butchering things. Let's put it right there. So you're not frying your freaking butthole every time you're butchering things. Not like it will happen anytime soon. Hey, man, you're stupid. Here he is. Hauling for me. What a guy. The poor buffaloes are slowly degrading. Slowly degrading all the food. It's not working out for them. They cannot feed themselves, but that's just the fate that has befallen us. Man, a permanent crack in the spine, huh? Just now realize this. That lowers the efficiency of moving to 68%. That's awful. <laughs> and she's constantly in pain. Thanks to all these scars and the crack in the spine and stuff. That's bad. Wow. Oh, but it's only a finger. I'm like, oh man, that's garbage. Man, everybody's hurt. And this guy has a prosthetic leg. Everybody has some kind of disability that prevents him from being a hopeful member of this society. Finally, a little bit of smooth sailing after all the crisis after crisis. I only have 64 pemmican left though, so my plan of having Cosme cook is not going to work out. No, you can't, you can uh, prioritize talking, huh? That's too bad. Uh, my plan of having Cosme cook is not going to work out. We're going to have to start cooking here, which is unfortunate, but what do you want me to do? There's nothing I can do. So we're going to unforbid that. Unsuspend the cook simple meals and Blurry will get around to it. Consuming the pemmican. No medicine, yeah, I know that. Everything's terrible. Everything's terrible. Wolf meat has rotted! This is not frozen. Because I cannot keep the door open. Well, I definitely don't want this to spoil. So I think now everything's dead outside. So we're going to just keep that open. Keep that door open. It should keep this frozen. And hopefully, like, I'm pretty sure wildlife, the wildlife tap is completely empty. Because everything has been poisoned to death. Unfortunate. <laughs> pretty terrible. How about these guys? Are they these guys just going to drop dead? Because of the toxic buildup? Doesn't look like it. Alright, Blargo, what are you even up to? You're deconstructing all this stuff. But I kind of want you to cook. I think I, I redid the priorities here and uh, he has constructing us a higher priority well that's too bad that's too bad i need you to go cook myself cargo pods please save me randy i got a fruit this means i can make some fine meals and i have the skill for it so that's great so i definitely want to haul this immediately and in fact Prioritize hauling. In fact, I'm going to use everybody to get some hauling done. Mostly. How are you doing resting? You're good enough. Hold that agave fruit. Bamboozle. You're terribly hungry. Well, you're going to haul some agave fruit. Oh, he's not allowed outside. Durr. Are you done with toxic bill? No, you're still garbage. So yeah, I'll, I'll just let you do I'll just let you be. These people keep coming inside my place. All right, that leaving. Get the hell out of my place. You, you already gave me all, everything I wanted. Now you can get the hell out. In between Blargo and Mosley, they'll probably get all the stuff. All that agave fruit. Yeah, that's good enough. Yeah, that's good. That's fine. All right. Now we can cook some fine meals. Or even more pemmican. Is that efficient, though? Do we want to cook pemmican? Or do we just... I think I want to do both, so let's just spend that, add bill, cook fine meal, and we'll do that until we have, until we have 10, drop it on the floor, only Blargo because he's the only one that can do it, so it doesn't really matter, the ingredient, ingredient radius only to the pantry, I forgot to do this for, for everything, so let's do that as well in uh, the pemmican, green radius only pantry, and the uh, simple meals only pantry. There you are. All right. Now we're going to get some get some de de delicious meals being cooked, or at least they will be decent. There you are. 
This is refrigerated. It's not freezing though. It's weird. I guess the temperature from here bleeds into the pantry. I wonder why they're no longer moving this. Um, maybe I forbid it. Moving the meat over here. I think I forbid it. Only to put potatoes and rice. Okay, we'll allow agave fruit and we'll allow some meat. So we can do some... How about you just haul it? Prioritize hauling. Then prioritize hauling so he can do some efficient efficient fine meal cooking. At the very least we'll, we'll get some sweet... Some sweet, sweet fine meals. That'll be a mood buff for everybody. Still wants that impressive bedroom. How's this looking? Only decent, huh? Even after I built you a freaking chess set. You garbage person. Do I have blocks? I have 10 blocks. Not enough to build a plant pot, apparently. Let's uh, build some more wooden pots, I suppose. Then I find meal to rush, baby. If it's poison, that <laughs> will be hilarious. But hey. He has a decent dining room, decent bedroom. This is this is nice. He's still greedy for that, but you know, better than he was doing before. He's still sick. How about mostly? Does he got toxic build of his minor? So I think we can let him outside again. He's going to be okay. How's this? Suppose in one day, suppose in 25 days. Alright. How about the Muffalos? Man, they still got lots of toxic buildup. It's so annoying. It's the absolute most annoying, absolute most annoying uh, condition that you can possibly have in, in RimWorld. But we're going to soldier through it. We're going to make it through. All right, restrict Bamboozle back. I mean, not, back to the outside. Actually, it was Bamboozle. Oh, he's still... He's still completely wrecked. Let's just let him stay indoors. I'm unfortunate. Whew. We got a little bit of a respite. What's going on now? Nothing's going on. Everything's fine. It's all fine. Bamboozle's gonna build that though? I don't think you should, Bamboozle. Is it really the only thing you can possibly do? He has a four. I don't want him to do that. I want him to haul and clean as much as possible before that happens. Ah, I can't wait until I wake up. And I've considered maybe editing out whatever uneventful things happen, but I don't like that. When I watch other people playing RimWorld, I'm like, I don't like that. I, I like to see absolutely everything, even when it's a little tedious. No, 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 no. I'm sorry, Bamboozle. I need Blargo to do that. He's rested enough. No, no, Rush Baby. Prioritize constructing that. There you are. <laughs> Uh, I don't want those to be built by incompetent fools like yourselves. I want Blargo to get it done. Poor. Womp womp. You just build that up. Normal. Alright, that's good enough. Slightly impressive. We got it. <laughs> now with the plant, it should be okay. Um, Blargo after... Let me just disable that overlay. Now after... The plants get in there. It should be good. And now Blargo's cooking some fine meals. Fantastic. Not a moment too soon. Everybody's hungry right now. Uh, I think I should put the meals, of course, out here. So let's see. We want all the meals out there. We don't want the meals inside because they will rot. There you are. Is this... Yeah, nice. Minus 10 degrees Celsius. There you are, everybody. Whew. Slowly. Slowly fighting through this crisis. How's this doing? 1.2 days? And now it's, now it's just a matter of time of, of recruiting this pool. Poor fool. 6.7. Man, that's a nice chunk. 1.6, I believe. I think 17 minutes of this part of the recording. I don't know how long I was. It was the other one, but this is a nice, peaceful time to leave. Hey, we got some limestone blocks and some marble blocks. We can build something with that, not sure what we can build some marble pots and get even better rooms major stupid slowly hauling all our wood to where he belongs mostly has nothing better to do so he's hauling the wood to our nice storage shed 
the sim thread as well is not going to be not going to be um, not going to be used for anything just yet. We have only four fine meals, so might as well unforbid this piece of elk meat. Uh, so at least we can use the agave fru fruit. Tony's idle. Who? Why are you idle, bamboozle? You have absolutely nothing to do, huh? Oh, because you're still stuck indoors. There's nothing I can do about this. This stupid toxic buildup just doesn't go away. It's infuriating. I'm just going to let him be. I don't think he has absolutely anything to occupy himself. And something I should do, didn't think about it until just now, is build roof so they can walk around. So they can walk around. There you are. The outside. Without getting poisoned. Didn't think about it until just now. Build that. All right. There's nothing else to do. Fantastic. Bargo is finally deconstructing all that. So let's floors. Remove floor. All that removed. Thank you. I know when Boozle is idle, but ah, he's going to sleep. It's all good. Why are you training these in tameness? Do you really need to do that? I guess so. Yeah, you have to maintain that. All right. All right. Blargo's cooking some more fine meals. We're barely scraping by. Winter just started. This is not going to be enough food. One of these, one of these poor, one of these poor, sad little muffalos is going to be sacrificed to our survival. I'm pretty sure about that, and that's okay. As long as they don't have the toxic buildup, we need to wait until this toxic buildup is gone. Otherwise, they will just be rot. They will be completely rotten when you sacrifice them, when you butcher them, which is tragic. Does it ever go away? It's so infuriating. And it doesn't seem to, to go down either. You just have to wait until it just suddenly disappears, I think. You have to be for a while not exposed. What are you up to mostly? Just minor. 37% is pretty decent. Pretty, pretty high. Alright. Well, there's nothing really I can do. Maybe I should build some more traps. I think I should definitely be, build at least one more trap. So let's build it right there. We'll move it... A, uh, whenever it's convenient, wherever it's convenient, or rather I'll just put it right there. We'll probably use it at some point. I think it's important to be prepared. Maybe I should look, start looking into building some walls. Of course, can't build a wall across the river. Can I? Never even tried. Yeah, you can build walls on top of the bridge. So that's a thing that can happen. The very least you can ensure that nobody goes around there. You can maybe use this, this outcrop, to build like a, a couple barriers. Hmm. Worth considering. Anyway, I'm going to leave it right here, where it's all peaceful and quiet. A nice, a nice change from all the terrible things that have been happening so far. Takes a fine meal, eats it alongside mostly. How are you guys getting along? Mostly a bamboozle. Mostly it's okay with Bamboozle, but boy does Bamboozle love mostly. Probably because he's so damn pretty. Look at that, beautiful. And he rescued. He got rescued by the man. Please, this toxic buildup. Make it go away. Make it go away. It's so infuriating. How are you doing? 6.7, we're almost there. Actually, a Pep is all, also almost there. All right. This is a good time. This is a good time to leave it. Hopefully you're having a good time. We averted all the crises, but it's only the beginning of the terrible, terrible things that will happen in the wasteland of despair. Hopefully you're looking forward to the next episode. I'll see you at that moment. Until then, don't get caught.